Nothing too crazy. Wait a minute. <gasps> what am I running right now? Oh my god. Hey guys, how's it going? So today we are back with episode 4 of The Sims 4 Rags to Riches journey that we've got going on on my channel. And if you haven't seen any of the episodes leading up to that, I'll link it up here or down below so you can check that out before watching this video. In the last episode, we were following around our girl Lucy again. We gained quite a bit of money in doing what we were doing. We were going on dates, trying to make money there. We were obviously going through with our painting, our gardening, all that rags to riches stuff and we completed level one of the mansion baron aspiration and look at our little house go it is so freaking beautiful i feel like we have worked so hard for this freaking house i've done a whole bunch of renos so again this is what we got oh no something is broken that did not last long at all but anyway yeah we've done a few renos we are on our way i would love to complete the second level of the mansion baron aspiration but i don't know how we're gonna do with that we need 100,000 simoleons to be put into our home and we are at 56,000 at the moment so we will see but I can definitely get that landscaping out of the way in like two seconds we will do that later basically if you guys have noticed what is going on with my regs to riches let's play basically is I'm going to do my best to earn a whole bunch of money during like the first half of the episode and then after that we are going to just go crazy with the building <laughs> anyway we need some fun I think what I'm going to do is call up my girl Bella. I really want to go on a date I tried my hardest to do a gold event with Bella recently So I think we're gonna go on a date and I want to see how this will go Hopefully she doesn't deny us again. She literally denied us last time in the meantime I really want to name my cow plant and I think someone said Lacey so we could be Lucy and Lacey. I think that's so cute So we have Lacey the cow plant over there. Bella has just got here. Okay, so will you please go on a date with me please <laughs> ask on date please by the way I tried so hard to get these buns symmetrical they're still not quite there but I tried my best okay <laughs> so we're going on a date finally oh my god where should we go I do want to do more dumpster diving so I think I'm gonna go on a date to this bar in Evergreen Harbor and after the date I can go dumpster diving and we can get money and sell the things that we find in the dumpster because we got a lot of money at the end of the last episode doing that and I need to go we need a hundred thousand dollars okay fine Finally, we have a gold event. Finally, I think I'm gonna give um, Bella here a quick makeover before we start because I just don't know how I feel. She's not wearing shoes. So <laughs> yeah, before this date starts, let's give Bella Giordano a quick little makeover here. <laughs> Nothing too crazy. Wait a minute. <gasps> oh, hold on. Who are you? Oh no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I didn't know this was a thing. Oh shoot, they have children. Bella, uh-oh. What do we do? I'm already on the date. Okay, well, I'm just gonna give her a makeover anyway. We are going to match her eyebrows. I'm gonna put some skin details on her. I don't know what to do. Oh my God, I might like pretend it is not a thing in my game. Like I might just pretend like Bella Giordano is just a townie. Like I don't really wanna break up their relationship. Maybe I'll go in and like set it so that they didn't even exist. Is that really bad? I just don't want that to be a thing in my game. I don't want that to be on my conscience. I don't know, maybe, okay, I don't know what to do. Let's just see how the date goes, okay? Let's just see how it goes, and if it goes well, then I'll just pretend that this whole thing never happened. I do like her hair. I don't even know if I'm gonna change it. I think it's really cute. We have drama. Oh my God, wait a minute, wait a minute. This is the first time I'm being in cast since the update. Hold up, oh my God, I wanna do her makeup. I really don't think that Bella would have a whole lot of makeup going on anyway. I think I'm just gonna add a little bit here. Maybe we just do something really subtle like that. Or this one, I'm gonna do this one. Oh my God, I love that we can play with the opacity. That is so nice. Anyway, let's get you an outfit while I call contemplate my life choices and what the heck we are planning on doing here. Okay, so this is the makeover that I gave to Bella Giordano. This is her everyday outfit. I also did her hot weather outfit and her cold weather outfit for now. We're gonna see how the date goes and I might just like delete her family from existence. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, anyway, let's go back. <laughs> we need this to go well though. We do be needing a goal level date. So we're gonna go and 
and um, hang out with Bella. Look how cute she is. I feel bad. I feel really bad. Let's just kind of order a drink here. Oh God, I don't have much money. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, I guess we're gonna be. We'll have a sweet and spicy, but I can only get one round because that's all I can afford. Cute. Okay, so yeah, mangle. Socialize with my date. We are just gonna ask about day. So how's your family? You know what's going on in your life? I really value the time we spend together. I think it's made us closer than ever. I need to start joking with my date, but I don't know how funny we are. So let's just tell a funny story. We've completed the goal. I need this to go a little bit better. The lighting is so weird in here. Should we do first kiss? I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Let's try. Let's try. She is. What the heck? Okay, they're having their very first kiss. Ah! Oh, so cute. Okay, no. Uh, no, I hate when the Sims just like, who? get out of here. I don't even know you. Very awkward encounter. Yeah, no kidding. We don't even know you. <laughs> that might be why it's been so hard to like start flirting. This actually makes a lot more sense. Oh, I don't know. I don't think we should pursue Bella. I'm gonna feel bad. Plus, we're having a really hard time getting flirty. So maybe that's not it. Like maybe this ain't it. Like I'm trying to just complete this last part here by getting them both be flirty at the same time. And it's not really working that great. It's not gonna lie. Silver medal. What? You know what? I'm, I'm getting the feeling it might not be meant to be here. Screw it. I'm just gonna go dumpster diving. <laughs> Die for deals. I'm gonna go home and sell and uh, I don't think it's gonna work out with Bella. Now she feels flirty. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised there's not really much around even though we've been here for so long. The dumpsters are like empty. Okay, whatever. We're leaving. Let's go to bed. <laughs> it's been a long freaking day. Um, We need to clean the toilet too. Oh my goodness. Okay. Shower. We were in the dumpster go to bed. Oh my god. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We need to talk to these gnomes all day, every day. Appease the gnome. If we can talk to those gnomes and sell the gnomes, and if they just like drop a couple plants here and there, that would be great. Appease the gnome. Give toy. Wait, where are they? Don't leave me gnomes. Normally, I hate these gnomes, but I need you more than ever. Oh no, they're all in my bedroom. Okay, great. <laughs> give salad. No. Give pie. Give coffee. I would be hella happy with that. That one's mad at me. I gave you a toy. What the heck? Plead for forgiveness. Oh yeah, I forgot we make money from the trash can now. Okay, that's great. I'm gonna start repairing some of these things. Not that because I don't want to die. I'm also gonna go out do my morning rounds. Um, she's her knees are not doing too hot, so maybe I have to take care of her first. Oh, yay! Yes, drop all of them. Drop them all. What are you getting this? I don't even know. Let me look. I'm also just kind of while I'm waiting gonna list this stuff back on Plopsy. I tried to sell it at the garage sale. That didn't work, but you guys did say that I could buy something to show off my paintings, which might be a good idea, so I think I might do that. Holly, I wonder if that sells well. Maybe Maybe I should go plant that. Cool, let's go do our morning rounds. Um, hopefully she's okay. Supercell! Oh my god, that's my favorite thing ever. We reached gardening level nine too. That is amazing. Honestly, I, I kind of want to like run a restaurant. I wonder how much money you actually make from that though. Is that a good idea? Have you guys done that before? I don't really know. Okay, so maybe today I can do a whole bunch of painting. We'll, we'll get a whole bunch of paintings in our inventory and then I can go and sell them in the city maybe. That might be a good idea. I think I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna paint pretty much for the rest of the night. She's not in the best mood anyway and she's getting tired so I'm just gonna keep painting and then I'm gonna buy that thing from City Living bring it down to the Cité and we are gonna sell our paintings on it she is talented we are getting our skills like up there okay we'll open this then go to sleep okay we're up I'm gonna get all of these little packs here open them and I'm also gonna sell my gnomes here <laughs> I love how you can have like friendships with them that is so funny okay yeah get in here you guys are <laughs> you guys are going I'm sorry $210 for that gnome morning rounds oh my god we reached level 10 yes nice we maxed that out. Hell yeah. Good job, Lucy. She's freaking killing it. Yay. I'm so happy. That's awesome. Okay. I'm also going to super sell all of this stuff over here. I think the next thing I want to max out is the painting skill. So I'm going to have her paint again. <gasps> Lucy, Bella. Oh my God. Bella is calling and wants to go on a date. I better not. No, we better not. I can't. I can't. I got to focus. Okay. Bella, I think might be a little bit of a bad influence on us. Assuming that we keep the marriage. I still, I still don't know. She's level eight of the painting skill. So we're getting there. What the hell? Okay. This random lady just came over and gave me a, a massage. What the frig is going on? Who are you? Where'd you come from? She literally just came in off the street. I'm just gonna... Uh, am I dreaming? <laughs> what? Okay, 
Anyway, I've spent all day painting and tending my garden. I'm actually gonna go tomorrow. I was gonna go tonight to um, to go sell my paintings, but I'm gonna wait and go tomorrow because this has been a pretty successful painting day. That was the weirdest thing ever. I wish I caught that. Cool, and we reached level nine for painting. Great. So yeah, I'm gonna let her do this tonight, tomorrow in the morning after we do our round. We're going to the city. I need to buy this thing. I don't even know, honestly, where you get it. <laughs> this is what I need. I need this. I need to put it in my inventory. Inventory. Can I do that? Yeah, okay, so I put that in my inventory I'm gonna set out onto the world and do a painting sale. Oh, this is great I hope you can mark them up and everything. Okay, I'm gonna go travel. We are going to the big leagues I should definitely go to the arts quarter. So I'm gonna travel there. Kyoko. I haven't seen Kyoko this episode Let's bring Kyoko along. This has been working so well I have never done this before but she has been killing it I have just been selling my paintings all freaking day one of them sold for like 10,000 simoleons and and yeah, this is definitely the best idea ever. I'm gonna just keep doing it until these are all gone. Oh, the romance festival. No, we're gonna go to the romance festival. Definitely, definitely. We're gonna get some of those other plants. I'm gonna plant some more of the birds of paradise for sure. If I can find them. Yes, okay, we sold all the paintings. I'm gonna put this thing back in my inventory and we're out of here. We're going to the romance festival. <laughs> all right, end the sale, done, and we're out of here. That was really, really good. We just made a lot of money from that. So where's the romance festival? Here, we're gonna bring Kyoko and Bella again. Let's hang out with our friends. We're not gonna talk to Bella. We're not bringing Bella over. Giordano. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna drink some tea. We'll, we'll pour the tea together, I guess. And I'm gonna harvest all of these plants. Dragon fruit plant. Okay, I don't think we've got those. What else do we have? Chrysanthemum flower and snapdragon and roses. I mean, no birds of paradise, but we'll take it. Okay, this is actually cute. The Bjergsen couple is here. They're just kind of like hanging out together. That's kind of adorable. But like, look how much money we made today. We can realistically probably like go home. Yeah, I'm gonna just chill with her friends for a little bit. All of Tinker is like the cutest sim in the whole world. I don't think I've ever seen her before, but look how cute she is. I think if I do one more day of that, then we might be able to upgrade our house and finish the Mansion Baron aspiration number two. And we have to do something for Lucy's birthday. Wait. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go home. Tomorrow, we are gonna do something for her birthday because we cannot just leave it. How can I make money for my birthday party? <laughs> oh, it's snowing. Oh, wait, the cow plant is alive. Hi! What's the one that will kill me? I need to feed it, right? Or no? Oh my god, all of my plants are gonna be out of season. This is not good. Super sell. Ooh, we can go to the flea market and sell my stuff. Okay, I'm gonna do that in the morning. And then we gotta do something for her birthday tonight. Maybe we'll have people over. I haven't decided. Okay, anyway, we're gonna go to the flea market. Yeah, I'm gonna participate in this. Fun, why not? So we're basically selling our flowers again or trying to sell our flower arrangement. She is so sad. We only, we got $600 from that sale. She's really sad right now though. So I'm just having her sit down and maybe like chat with some people because she's real sad. And then we're gonna plan the birthday party. We've kind of just met this sim. This is Kato Akiyama. So we are gonna discuss interests. I guess we just need to talk. I need to talk to someone. Kato is a data wrangler at a far seer data corporation. Cool. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna throw a birthday party at my house and like I kind of want it to be a paint party and then I can sell the paintings. So I'm gonna go home. We're gonna plan this. She's actually feeling okay. That got her social up. We're gonna leave and I'm gonna try and figure out how I can do a paint party for her birthday. I think that'd be really cute, fun, and I can make money off of it. Uh, all of them painting in the snow. That'd be adorable. Okay, I'm gonna pause. I need to, I need to do some research. So apparently we have to create a club and then everyone comes over and then they can paint with me. So it's gonna be like a painting club. So I'm gonna create a club. Paint club. <laughs> Come paint with me. Requirements. <laughs> Must be good at painting. Just kidding. We don't really have any. Club activities. We have to paint, paint, hobbies. We paint. That's all we have to do. I think I just want to do paint. All we do is paint. <laughs> and I'm going to add some members. I guess this is who's going to come to my birthday party. Okay. We're going to add Kyoko, obviously. We're going to add Bella Goth. Kenji? Maybe Moira. She invited us to the garden gnomes. I mean, I guess we could include her. Let's add Kato. We just met Kato. Do we add Bella Giordano? Maybe we can be friends with Bella. Or not. Okay. Just kidding. <laughs> so these are gonna be the people in my group. We are gonna do this. I've never done this before. I don't really know what I'm doing, to be honest. Congratulations, Lucy has successfully created the Paint Club Club. <laughs> now it's time to recruit new members and hit the town. Fun! Start gathering. How do I make this count as my birthday party? I do need to buy more easels. I think I'm gonna make them go outside because look how freaking cute this is. So let's get more easels. Maybe I'll just bring my own easel outside so we don't have to buy another one, but I need five. One, two, three, five easels. Done and done. They can all like paint 
paint in a circle like you do. And then, oh wait, I need to make a cake. Oh my God, I have so much to do. We're gonna make a cake. Please don't die making your own birthday cake. Let's bake this cake. Be careful, girl. Put some birthday candles on that. Don't eat it. And okay, you know what? Let's just start the gathering. Start gathering. Yay, they're on their way. Oh, I'm excited. All right, I'm gonna go start painting, I guess. Okay. Kato is the first one here. Cute. All right, let's, um, let's, Paint. Oh, this is so much fun. All right, Kato's here. I'm gonna go ahead and paint right on next to him. Kenji's here. Oh, Kenji looks actually really cute in his glasses. Bella, and where's Kyoko? Oh, Kyoko's coming. Wait, did I not buy enough easels? I didn't buy enough easels. Kyoko needs one. I'm so sorry. There we go. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Don't you go on the computer. We are doing a, a group activity. Oh, this is so cute. And we can like talk to each other while we're doing this. This is my kind of birthday idea. I feel like I would have a blast doing this. Like all your friends just coming over, kind of just painting in the backyard. I mean, I would personally probably have like a little drink tray set up, some snacks also, but like this looks like a time. And I'm getting my skill up and I'm I'm gonna sell all your paintings. Okay, wait, I wanna go blow out the candles before everyone leaves because that would be really, really sad, but I'm gonna go blow out candles. I hope everyone comes to celebrate with me. This is adorable. I don't wanna miss it. Oh God, oh God, wait, I gotta get my picture. <laughs> okay, we can resume. Yay! They're like, why are we not painting? Kenji is pissed. <gasps> I aged up. Lucy aged up. Aww. Where the heck did she go? Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh my God. Okay, and yes, Tina, I would love you to come over and help me fix my record player that has been broken for so long. Of course you can come help. I kind of want Tina to be part of my group. That is so sweet. I really love the like vibes that we're getting with her friendships and everything. Like I'm really content with the people that we know. Don't die, please. Also, imagine she just came over and died trying to help me. She fixed it. What a sweetheart. Thank you. Can I invite you to join my group? Am I able? Clubs, invite to club. Oh no, we don't have enough room for new members. How do I get more room? Wait, oh, we need more points. Um, and then I'm gonna invite her because that was really nice. Thank you, Tina. What a sweetheart. Anyway, I'm gonna go out here and paint. My whole my whole crew is out here without me. Do you mind if I hang out for a bit? How has your day been? Tina, my girl, she's so nice. This is so fun. I literally am like jealous right now. I wish I had A, this many friends, B, this nice a house, and C, um, a group to hang out with to do this. And then I'm gonna sell all of their paintings uh, the next day. Lucy Ghost makes paint club the only place I wanna be. <laughs> Oh, I'm done. Okay, I'm gonna put this on my inventory. Oh, this one's done too. We're gonna put that in my inventory. <laughs> These are all done. Put in inventory, put in inventory. I thought they were maybe still working on that, but I guess not. They literally all just come over and paint. Why did I not do this earlier? Oh what my, we really need this free love thing to stop. <laughs> What am I running right now? Oh my God. Okay, 258. I'm gonna add another member so I can invite Tina. I'm gonna have to buy another easel. <laughs> this is so cute. Are you kidding? I'd love to join paint club. Of course you would. You're the nicest person in the whole wide world. I need another easel. We've actually kind of been getting to know Kato because they've been painting beside us the whole time. Oh my God. I love everything about that picture. And we just learned that they are adventurous. So um, I'm kind of glad we introduced ourselves to him when we were feeling upset. Imagine we maxed out like everyone's skill here. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna end this pretty soon. Maybe when I finish my own painting, we'll end it. Um, and then tomorrow I'm gonna go and sell these everywhere. Put in inventory. Yeah, I think we can end this meeting. It's midnight. My birthday has happened. Everything is great. Yeah, I'm gonna just end. How do I end this? End gathering. Bye guys. Oh, that was so cute. I really, really like this. I'm going to put all of these in my inventory. Any of the ones that are done. Maybe they'll stay here and keep painting. I mean, by all means, do your thing. But I'm gonna go inside. I'm going to take care of her needs and go to bed. And then tomorrow I'm gonna hit the town and go sell all of the paintings that we have in our inventory now. How many do I have? We have eight classic ones, two little ones, and whatever else they finished today. So I would consider that a win. Okay, yeah, and they finished like a few more of these. This is great. It's rebate day. Everything is for sale. I mean, that actually might not help me. <laughs> oh, we're selling something on Plopsy. Wait, sell on Plopsy. Ship our bills. Oh no, 2,000. Okay, yeah, we are definitely going to go and sell some stuff today. <laughs> all right, let's go out on the town. Did we ship this? Ship on Plopsy. Let's go out on the town with our paintings. We're gonna get out of here. I have so much paintings to sell. So hopefully we can mark this up, sell it for a decent amount, and then we can do some renos on the house. Maybe I'll go to the park this time. So I'm gonna go here. We're gonna place this in world. Market prices to 300%, start the yard sale. Let's do it. Come and get it. Honestly, I am having so much fun with this let's play. I'm really happy that you guys are having fun too. Like I haven't had this much fun with gameplay in a hot minute. You must be freezing. Right off the bat, we've already sold some stock table. Yeah. I'm 
I'm just gonna keep doing this till we sell them all. I've already made over $10,000, um, so great. Okay, we sold them all. I'm gonna put this back in my inventory and we're gonna get the heck out of here. Cool, I'm gonna go home and I don't think I actually did my morning rounds today in my garden, so maybe we'll do that. And then we can uh, do some retos. I, yeah, I'm gonna wait till the next day. I don't want the rebate thing on. Normally you would, but I wanna spend money. <gasps> Bella is an elder. Let's go to the humor and hijinks festival. Okay, <laughs> bring some friends along. <gasps> Moira aged up too. We're getting old. Oh my God, okay. We're gonna go to humor and hijinks. We're gonna try and win the thing because I really wanna get the voodoo doll, which we can sell. Um, But what the heck? Bella is an elder. I'm so, oh, she's the cutest. She's so cute. She's an elder, young adult, Kyoko. How old are you? Adult. Oh my God, I did not expect that, but okay, we're getting old. Oh my goodness. Kato is up here performing the freaking karaoke or like stand up or something, but like, okay, get it, adventurous king. We won. Okay, so we got fireworks, a voodoo doll, and $500. Nice. Okay, there's fireworks. Okay, I gotta, I gotta leave. This is so loud. Oh my goodness. We gotta go. Let's go home. Let's do some renos. My goodness. All right, we're home. Let's sleep it off. We're done. Let's go to bed. And then in the morning, when this rebate day is over, there we go. Now we can renovate. Okay, so what do we have? I need to spend all of my money, basically, in order to do this. I really want to do the landscaping, first of all. So let's start building. So I'm going to work back here. I also want to kind of redo part of my garden because I have all of this room back here. And I also really want to build, like, maybe something for the paint group. So I'm going to move all of this stuff kind of back here a little bit. And I'm going to start spending a lot of money on landscaping. Maybe all of our debug plants can go and I can actually buy, like, real plants. <laughs> they literally just started, like, snow blowing outside my house, by the way. So if you hear that, I apologize. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to delete all of the landscaping. We're going to redo it. We're going to actually spend money on it. Did my cow plant die already? Lazy, no. Oh, I wonder if we can revive. I feel bad. Oh my God. We didn't even get to interact like at all. I mean, maybe knowing me, that's probably a good thing. All right. I think I've got all my landscaping. I'm going to start buying some actual stuff. So I'm going to start around my house. Then we're going to work our way to the back and do around the pond, around the paint area, around the garden. This stuff can get real expensive. Like I probably will spend at least $10,000 out here with this stuff. It sucks that we're in the winter. So it's not even going to like look good at the moment, but <laughs> it's okay. In the spring, these things are going to be blue. We are definitely going to be starting to go on more of the expensive side at this point. Like we need to spend $100,000 on our house and that's quite a bit, honestly. Like considering what we have, it's going to take quite a bit to be able to get to that point. So I'm going to start going a little more expensive with like my flowers and everything. It sucks. Like I can't even tell what this looks like right now. <laughs> so I'm probably going to just do this part myself because honestly, like you can't even see it. <laughs> so I'm just going to go ahead, finish up uh, the landscaping for the moment. I've already already spent about 5,000 simoleons. I think I'm gonna get rid of this too because this was free, this was debug, all of this debug stuff could go. And I've also kind of moved over my yard because I kind of had my trees like moved inwards a little bit because I didn't want my lot to look so empty. But now that we are expanding and growing, I'm definitely going to move everything over because we just added so much space to our lot just there. I'm going to move over my garden too. This is gonna be so annoying, oh my God. Okay, wait, I'm gonna use my cats and dogs fence here. I'm going to build a big old garden over on the side and we can even have a little gate. I want the entrance to the gate to be cute. So I'm adding uh, again, flowers that you can't really see here, but I've spent like $15,000 on the landscaping at the moment. So you can tell, like you can just imagine how much there is in this thing. I've organized the garden over there. I just bought this pergola, which I'm going to put all of the little painting things under it. And then this is going to be so cute for them to come and paint. I'm going to do the lights. We're going to do the toddler lights out there. And yeah, that is going to be so adorable. I think I might change the color though. I don't know what color the flowers are. <laughs> maybe we'll just leave it for now. We can decorate. I think I might put just maybe a couple plants out here. Uh, maybe just, I don't know, some, some more lighting. I do want to do a seating area out here too because I did get rid of that bench. So I'm going to put a bench over here. Oh, outdoor fireplace would be so cute. Okay, that bench can stay. I'm going to do some landscaping around it. I'm getting ahead of myself. We're going to put some of these cute little lanterns around, maybe just like that. I kind of want to put some around here too. So maybe I'll do... Just a few on the corners. And then maybe by the lake, we could do a little outdoor fireplace like seating area. So I'm gonna get the one from Snowy Escape. Obsessed with it, it's so pretty. This one is gonna be kind of like the little area that we did for the bubble dome homes. So I'm gonna get the outdoor chairs. Like we're gonna do this. 
maybe I can get just a little thing like that. It's huge. And then people can kind of just come and hang out over here. And I'm going to do some landscaping around that as well. <laughs> Normally my Sims are not this social either, but I feel like I'm kind of like emphasizing the fact that she has a lot of friends. Like normally my Sims have no one. <laughs> they don't go anywhere. They don't leave the house. Rip quarantine challenge. <laughs> we could put the barbecue over here. I really want to use this one. I love this one so much. This is base game. Came with one of the new updates this year. Really adorable. I'm going to put that there. And then let's go inside. What did I have to upgrade? I did have to upgrade the computer because I accidentally lost her old one. So we're going to sell that. I'm going to get her a new one. Not that she really uses it that often yet. Maybe in her old age, I'll have her right. We can start maybe learning soon. So should I like splurge and get the $10,000 computer just to do it? Why not? <laughs> we do have to spend the money, right? So I've got that. I kind of want to do her bedroom also. I think I'm going to change the wallpaper in here. Let's do a bedroom reno. The bedroom and like the entire upstairs didn't really get that much love in the last reno. So let's do this up here. I don't know. Maybe we can kind of go with the gray. I'm going to delete the mirror. We can get a nicer mirror. We'll do a jungle adventure mirror in here. Maybe I'll do like the darker shade. I can get some decorations and plants and stuff in here because we really have nothing. We could do a laundry bin. I could do get like a laundry machine. Maybe I could put laundry over here because we are dumpster diving like it's no tomorrow. So maybe we, maybe it's about time we get one of those. I actually don't think I've even sold the stuff that we got from the dumpster last time. I didn't. Wait, here's my computer. What the heck? Okay, you guys know. You guys saw the last episode. This was not here. I swear. I'm going to sell it. You know what? I'm over it. Yeah, I'm going to do a little laundry moment over here. So let's do laundry day. I'll do a double laundry machine just kind of like right over here, I guess. Obviously, we'll do some clutter and everything around here too. Maybe I can put this up. Yeah, I think I like that over here. Maybe I'll use this rug here too. We'll just kind of like put one. Her house is coming along. Honestly, I'm really, really content. Cool. So now we have a laundry station. We're making use of that over there. Um, I think I'm going to do maybe a lamp or another plant over in this corner. And then our upstairs area is going to come together. Maybe a rug. Maybe a vintage glamour rug moment. Okay. And I do need to renovate the bathroom up here too because I don't even have toilet paper. I don't have any of that. So let's take care of that before we do anything else. Maybe I can put a laundry hamper in here too. So maybe I'll move my toilet over. We can do laundry hamper in the corner. I don't think I've even had my sim do laundry. Like, this is the moment. We are doing so many fun things in this let's play that I've never done before because I just built in this game. <laughs> We're gonna get a garbage can for in here. I'm gonna put that maybe like right there. I'm feeling tiny living bathroom set and maybe a rug and that's it. Let's use a tiny living one in here too. Why not? Maybe I'll change the color of it. We can do like a pink one. Done. There we go. Beautiful. Now we have money to change some of the lighting other than the saucer lights everywhere. So we've got that. I'm going to carry on doing a little bit more renos in my bedroom. And then I think I'm going to go back downstairs. So I've got my candles happening with my end tables there. They're kind of clipping a little bit. I'm just going to move them out. Maybe we can put up some of these in here. I do want to put up more plants on my end tables as well. I'm going to do a nice snowy escape fluffy rug under my bed. Maybe an ottoman here too. This thing is actually here from collecting all those stupid vending machine things. So I'm going to keep that, I guess. I don't know if I want to keep my TV or not. I think I'm going to sell the TV. I can put something else on here. We don't even watch. TV like ever. I feel like she's never even home to be honest. So I think I might leave this as my bedroom for now. The only thing I might do is put a shelf over there also because it looks a little bare. Maybe I'll just put that up. Then we can go downstairs. Maybe upgrade the kitchen. I gotta look and see what we have. Okay, so this is my bedroom for now. I'm gonna move out of here. What do we have going on down here? I still need something to put in the middle and I have no idea what to put. I think I can probably actually renovate my kitchen. I think I should do that. I might actually renovate this whole part. Then we can put the dining room in the middle. Maybe do like a around island or something. So I'm going to delete this stuff. I have so much food in my inventory at all times. Okay, yeah, all of this is going to go. I'm going to do a wraparound kitchen that way. Island here, dining room down the middle. And I think that's going to look a lot better. So let's go get our kitchen essentials. I think we can go maybe get this fridge now. Like we're at the point where we can start getting a little bit bougie, I think. Let me get some counters. I don't know where I want to go with the counter situation. I'm going to try the island living counters. The only thing that is really annoying is my freaking curtains are going to clip to it, but that's okay. So I'm going to do my kitchen wrapping around like this. And then maybe a nice bar moment kind of coming out this way. Let's grab this one. And then I do need a sink also. Garbage can can stay. We're going to just put that one right there. And now that I have my essentials, I'm going to go ahead and do my chairs. So I kind of think I'm going to change my color scheme, but I've been playing around with it. And I don't know what, where I want to go with it. I kind of, I, I do like what we had going, but I feel like Lucy is more of like, she's got a green thumb. She loves the outdoors. I feel like I should incorporate more like green 
greenery in here. That might be um, the route that I'm gonna take. We'll see. I've kind of been playing around with it a lot and honestly nothing is sticking, but I'm gonna clutter up my kitchen. Then I'm gonna move out and do my dining room and I'm gonna try and clutter the kitchen in the way that I'm kind of visualizing at the moment. Her interests are very just like outdoorsy. I don't know. I feel like I just have to match that vibe a little better. So now that we are kind of like getting to a point where we have a lot of money, we can try and customize it more to Lucy and her style. Cute. Okay, so there's the kitchen so far. I'm gonna do, maybe this can move over and then dining room can go straight down the middle. I'm gonna try that. Let's get a table. Honestly, now that we have more friends, I feel like we can go bigger with it. Uh, it is a high top table though and I don't know what chairs to go with now. I don't know if I should match the Get Famous ones or do different ones. I think I'm gonna do these ones for this table here. For the island, maybe we could do that from Realm of Magic and then the Get Famous ones over here. Like that? Actually, yeah, you know what? I think I kind of like that. I wish I had a green swatch for this. Dang it, that's okay. It's fine. I don't personally like this as a centerpiece, but for Lucy, I think I like it. And then let's maybe try something like this for my rug. Actually that, I think I like that with the color scheme. That looks good. I'm gonna change the swatch of this over here. There we go. I'm also gonna change up my lighting in here. This is already looking like a whole new house. I'm so excited. I think I'm gonna work towards having another like full on green room part of the house. That's probably gonna be the next expansion that we go for. I think I'm just gonna kind of change the swatches around for my living room over here because everything kind of looks different now. I can match it to my chairs. That's kind of fun. Oh yeah, I like what's happening here. I definitely really like the changes that we've made. I'm happy about this. I'm gonna quickly check where we're at with our aspiration here and... <gasps> We did it! We did it! We did it! We did it! Milestone complete! Yes! We've done it! Oh my god! Yay! Okay, so we did a whole bunch of renovations back in the backyard. This is so cute. I feel like I could even add like more lighting and stuff around, but look at our little paint area in the spring. That's gonna look so pretty. Our little garden over here. Um, the outside, like exterior of the actual house, we didn't do much, but on the inside, we have a complete recolor in here. We've redone our dining room, our kitchen, the house looks so, so much better. I'm really, really happy with it. And oh God, girl, get in the shower. And then upstairs, we have finished up our bedroom as well. Yeah, we've got a laundry room. Like, look at us go. So this is the conclusion of this episode. Let me know what you guys think about the renos. Let me know what you guys think about the paint party, the new relationships that are forming. I feel like we have covered, this episode is gonna be like a million years long. <laughs> but that's all I got for you guys. Let me know how you guys are enjoying this. Let's play and thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode.